Hello friends, welcome to etltestingtutorial.com. Today we are going to discuss different different reporting queries that uh, usually come to me like why reporting we need, what all reporting tools we have and which tool I am going to use. So the, in this uh, in this complete module we'll discuss about different different reporting concepts that we need and here I have listed all of the topics. So these all are the things that we need to cover. Why reporting we need, what all reporting tools, what all testing that we can perform within the reports and which tool I am going to use. Right. So let's, let's jump on to the very first topic. What are reports? So report is the visualized format. Is the visualized format means the graphical representation in the bar charts, in the line charts, in the pie charts, in the uh, this is a percentage chart, this is the pie chart. And these are the different different modules that are present within that pie chart. So reports are the thing that is required after performing the like very first thing that we perform is ETL. After performing that ETL thing we need to generate the reports. Reports means how the data is being passed and how we are getting the like the same example that I explained in the uh, very first topic for the ETL overview like what is ETL within ETL within that topic I just explain let's say if we have the jungle launch hotel that is present within the uh, Delhi within Pune within Chennai within Mumbai and the chairman of that that hotel just want to see in which season people are uh, like coming to that hotel are in which from which location this is in maximum demand from which website make my trip or India because from which website users are coming so that question can be answered with the help of the data warehouse if we have the data warehouse within data warehouse we will generate the output for that but that output is not as much user uh, that is not as much attractive right so that can be done only if we have the graphical represent if we generate like within Delhi that hotel is uh, within the month of June and July people are visiting more from the make my trip website from of which age group right so these all things can be answered if we have the visualized format of that data that we'll get if we have the reports if we have the graphical representation for that right so this is how I can say that reports are the visualized format the graphical representation that will that is used a lot that will make that will make our that will make our complete output as attractive okay and if I visit our website let's see it's here etltestingtutorial.com and if I scroll down you will see that we have separate modules on that business intelligency that is ETL plus the reports that is the output of that uh, data warehouse in the graphical format so these all things we'll cover as part of our tablet tool as i just said okay so reports are a very important part that plays a very important role if we are implementing that uh, etl process so reports are the last level okay and that we'll see right so this is the all thing that i I'll discuss as part of my current session. In the next session, we'll discuss about what all reporting tools that we have, which one is in a most demand, and which one is uh, used a lot, and which one is in a less demand. We'll discuss about everything. Okay.